In this video, we are going to discuss the question Find all values of x that satisfy the equation x divided by x plus 1 to the whole square plus x divided by x minus 1 to the whole square is equals to q square plus q where q belongs to r. We have a square plus b square on the left side where a is equals to x divided by x plus 1 and b is equals to x divided by x minus 1. The formula for a square plus b square is equals to a plus b whole square minus 2ab. Hence, this gives us a plus b whole square is x divided by x plus 1 plus b is x divided by x minus 1 whole square minus 2 multiplied by h x divided by x plus 1 and b is x divided by x minus 1. This is equals to q square plus q. The common factor in the denominator is x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1. So this gives us x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1 and in the numerator we have to cross multiply x by x plus 1 and x by x minus 1. So this gives us x multiplied by x minus 1 plus x multiplied by x plus 1 whole square minus 2 multiplied by x multiplied by x is x square divided by x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1. This is equals to q square plus q. This gives us x multiplied by x is x square minus x multiplied by 1 is x plus x multiplied by x is x square plus x divided by x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1 whole square minus 2x square divided by x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1 is equals to q square plus q. Now this gives us here minus x and plus x will cancel out to give x square plus x square which is 2x square divided by this is in the form of a plus b multiplied by a minus b a minus b where a is equals to x and b is equals to 1. The formula for a plus b multiplied by a minus b is a square minus b square. This gives us 2x square divided by a square is x square and b square is 1 square which is equals to 1 x square minus 1 and this is whole square minus 2x square 2x square divided by Again here, x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1 is x square minus 1. 2x square divided by x square minus 1. This is equals to q square plus q. Now, 2x square divided by x square minus 1 this term is present here and here 
And in order to simplify this equation, let's consider 2x square divided by x square minus 1 edge u. Now the equation becomes u square minus u is equals to q square plus q. Taking q square and q to the left side gives us u square minus q square minus u minus q is equals to 0. Now this is in the form of a square minus b square which is equals to a plus b multiplied by a minus b where a is equals to u and b is equals to q. So this gives us a plus b multiplied by a minus b. a plus b is u plus q multiplied by u minus q. Here taking minus 1 common gives us minus of u plus q is equals to 0. Now we have u plus q common in both these terms. Hence taking u plus q common gives us u plus q. Now the remaining values are u minus q, u minus q minus 1. This is equals to 0. So this gives us u plus q multiplied by u minus q minus 1 is equals to 0. Since we have 0 on the right side, either this term is equals to 0 or this term is equals to 0. When u plus q is equals to 0, we have u is equals to minus q. Previously, we have taken u equals to 2x square divided by x square minus 1. So this is equals to minus q. Multiplying both sides by x square minus 1 gives x square minus 1 in the numerator and denominator will cancel out to give 2x square is equals to minus q multiplied by x square is minus qx square and minus minus plus q multiplied by 1 is q adding qx square to both sides will cancel these two terms to give 2x square plus qx square is equals to q taking x square common gives us x square multiplied by 2 plus q is equals to q. Now dividing both sides by 2 plus q gives us x square is equals to q divided by 2 plus q. Now, taking square root of both sides gives us x is equals to plus or minus square root of q divided by 2 plus q. Since the denominator 
cannot be zero hence q is not equals to minus 2 so q is not equals to minus 2 because when q is equals to minus 2 the denominator will be zero which will give us an infinite number now for the second term u minus q minus 1 is equals to 0 this gives us u equals to q plus 1 previously we have considered u equals to 2x square divided by x square minus 1 hence this is equals to q plus 1 Now multiplying both sides by x square minus 1 gives us now x square minus 1 will cancel out in the numerator and denominator to give 2x square is equals to q plus 1 multiplied by x square minus 1. This gives us 2x square is equals to q multiplied by x square is equals to qx square. q multiplied by minus 1 is minus q. One multiplied by x square is x square plus x square and 1 multiplied by minus 1 is minus 1. Now this gives us 2x square is equals to qx square plus x square minus q minus 1. Subtracting x square from both sides gives us this x square will cancel out and 2x square minus x square is x square is equals to qx square minus of q plus 1. We take minus 1 common from here. Now, adding q plus 1 to both sides. and subtracting x square from both sides gives us plus q plus 1 and minus q plus 1 will cancel out and plus x square and minus x square will cancel out to give q plus 1 on the left side is equals to qx square minus x square this gives us q plus 1 is equals to we have x square common here and stacking x square common gives us x square multiplied by q minus 1 now Dividing both sides by q minus 1 gives q minus 1 will cancel out in the numerator and denominator to give x square is equals to q plus 1 divided by q minus 1. Taking square root to both sides gives such x is equals to plus or minus square root q plus 1 divided by q minus 1 where q is not equals to 1 because when q is equals to 1 the denominator will be 0 this is our next set of answers hence 
there is a total of four solutions x is equals to square root of q plus 1 divided by q minus 1 and minus square root of q plus 1 divided by q minus 1 and square root of q divided by 2 plus q and minus square root of q divided by 2 plus q where q is not equals to 1 and q is not equals to minus 2 so these are our answers